Developmental stuttering, what is it? And if your child exhibits it, what can you do as a parent? So we've consulted the Oracle and it says developmental stuttering is most common in children, usually starting between the ages of two and five. It involves repetition of sounds, syllables or words. For most children, stuttering improves with age, but for some it may persist into childhood. Now, I asked ChatGPT about the magic age of seven to see whether what I'd heard years ago was actually true, that if your child is still stuttering by the age of seven, that they become self-aware and stuttering kind of embeds itself and it's harder to get rid of. So is that true? And it says at around the age of seven, children often become more self-aware of their stutter. This increased awareness can lead to anxiety, frustration and even embarrassment, which can exacerbate the stuttering. If not addressed, the emotional aspects, the fear of stuttering, or avoiding speaking can embed the stutter, making it harder to overcome. Now, I know myself that I don't think I was aware. <laughs> I don't think I was aware. I was obviously stuttering. At least I'm pretty sure I was obvi- obviously stuttering to some extent. But I don't think anybody picked it up until I was about nine and to be perfectly honest, I wish they hadn't. Um, so I'm just throwing that out there. For me personally, I think my life might have been slightly different if nobody told me that I had a stutter. It was picked out by the speech therapist who came around each year and tested you, uh, saying A, B, C, or well, saying the alphabet and counting to 10. And I knew that each year when we got tested, there was something about this that I was worried about. But I used to get through it by saying 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, or A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, I, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. I haven't said that for a long time. <laughs> And I knew that if I said it fast enough, I'd get through. I thought I got through this time. Anyway, my point is, my point is, is that for me, I was blissfully unaware of my stutter when I was seven and eight. And I think I was nine or ten because I was about standard three in New Zealand schooling, which I'd say is about nine or ten. So, yes, ignorance was bliss for me. Anyway, what does it say on here? Uh, what can parents do? So stay calm and patient. Create a supportive... Th- this is for developmental stuttering, full stop. So this is at any age, basically, okay? So stay calm and patient if, the, if you're the parent. Create a supportive and low-pressure environment, generally. Encourage open communication. So let your child express their feelings about stuttering without judgment. I don't know that a child would do that but maybe they do maybe they do reduce anxiety avoid interrupting or finishing their sentences give them time to speak yeah maybe i was actually aware of my stuttering because i think i think my parents used to do that when i was younger Hmm. very hard to know when you're a lot older Speech therapy, a speech language pathologist and SLP can help with fluency techniques and emotional support and model slow relaxed speech. So show how to speak clearly without rushing, which can help the child feel more confident. And I know that I have seen parents that have spoken really, really fast and they have told me about their children struggling to not stutter and I've been thinking maybe they were trying to keep up with mummy or daddy. So, I'm no expert on developmental stuttering. Consult a speech language pathologist or speech therapist near you. But stay calm and patient. Encourage open communication. Reduce anxiety. Consider speech therapy. And model, model slow, relaxed speech. You're the role model. Until next time, bye for now.